Okay, so this question asks us to work out the values of x and y. It's got two letters involved and two equations. So this is about a topic called simultaneous equations. Now, depending on how much practice you've done on these type of equations, then what we recognise with simultaneous equations is we've got to uh, do some subtractions or additions or multiplications, do something with these equations so we can get in a situation where when we add or subtract um, new equations, one of the letters cancels out and disappears to leave us with one letter to solve. Um, we can't solve equations with two letters where we've just got one equation. And that's why we've got two of them here, they're simultaneous. So it says work out these values. So 2x plus 3y equals 15 and a half. Um, if I double the bottom one, then I can say that both of those will have 2x in. So I'm going to double, double the bottom equation. So double x plus y equals 6. So that gives me 2x plus 2y equals 12. I'm now in a position to subtract the equations. So subtract the two equations to cancel out 2x. So we end up with y is equal to 3.5. Substitute this into x plus y equals 6 to find x. So we get x plus 3.5 equals 6, so x equals 2.5. We then check that 2x plus 3y equals 15.5. So we do 2 times the x value, which was 2.5 plus 3 times the y value, which was 3.5, 2 times 2.5 is 5, 3 times 3.5 is 10.5, 10.5 plus 5 is 15.5, and, and that's what we wanted, so the check worked. So when you're doing simultaneous equations, then the key idea is to make one of the equations change. Sometimes you'll change both of them to give you the same value of x's or y's, or whatever the letters are in your question. Um, but you're going to create two equations with the same number of x's or the same number of y's in, such that you can then add the equations or subtract them, whichever way it has to be, to then cancel out the letter that you have the same number in front of it, or the same coefficient in front of it, to find the value of one of the letters. And then once you've got the value of one of the letters, you can substitute that value into one of the equations to find the value of the other letter. And once you've got the two values that you think work, you should then check those two values in the equation that you haven't used to get the second value. So simultaneous equations, quite a popular topic, um, worth practicing because again it practices uh, solving equations at the same time. So uh, worth spending some time on it guys. So we found the x value was worth two and a half and the y value was worth three and a half.